Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Star Drive 2 with me, Get Daved. Last time we visited the Authoridan system. They're increasing the population cap here. Great, keep up the good work. It'll be a while before they're really helping out much, but when they arrive, they'll be fantastic. Actually, I'm tempted to start. Ooh. They don't have the production bonus my people do. Uh, we might have to do a population swap there. Oh no, that's just the abundant one. Sorry, I was figuring things out wrong. I'm not going to bother with industrial infrastructure. This is going to be more of a normal planet. Uh, I don't think I'm going to super pump production here. It just, the ceiling is going to be a bit too low. So we'll just go with a bit more of a standard build. Great work, Alan Torn Bell. We'll just keep them trading goods for now. Actually, no. We'll get them working on a colony ship because I'm going to want to colonize a uh, happy town pretty quickly here. So we can get extra nano cash because, oh my goodness, nano cash is amazing. I accidentally forgot to click something. We'll be alright. Yeah, they don't have a prayer. So we're going to do one thing. We're going to move the bombers nice and safely away. And everybody else, we're going to go for it. I like how they're shooting the one that has strong forward shielding. Well, what are you waiting for, fighters? There we go. They can sometimes be a little finicky. Alright, bet how many seconds it's going to take for the fighters to destroy this thing, or, if like, uh, compared to when the heavy weaponry gets in range. I think the answer was zero. Boy, they just ripped it apart. And I loved it. So, every time it lags like this, I want you to imagine it's like the end of a movie where it's like the freeze frame, where people like are doing a high five or whatever. So the star base is exploding and it's just freeze frame. That's, that's how we're going to deal with that in the future. It's not a bug, it's a feature. Um, I will capture it. Okay, we will destroy it. Yay! Spying enhancements. Incidentally, the polyp farming thing is using a lawnmower, which is kind of horrifying if you think about it. Alright, this is uh, rich, so it's pretty good. Let's just check the government meter. I thought we already had two Latinums. Maybe it just hasn't tallied them yet since we took this place over. Um. Oh, goodness. How did they get so powerful? Do your thing, guys. And I kind of would like to take over... I'll shoot that down real quick. I don't know, take over that other colony. Maybe I'll take over some space up there as well.
This is kind of dangerous for them to take that journey unescorted, but uh, maybe it'll be okay. I feel real bad. Ooh! <laughs> Which is nice if you like. I do like blue more than red. I do! So let's just investigate how exactly that worked. Is it only on laser cannons? I suppose that wouldn't apply to disruptors or anything. Also, the ECM jammer works way better than defensive flares, so keep that in mind. Okay. Forget that. <laughs> Get the whole gang back together. Got a pretty good empire going here with the world's worst highway network. Um, oh, he won't be back for a while. Um, he's actually going to cause an incident if he stays there much longer, so we'll just have it retreat for now. Uh, It'd be kind of nice to check out that... Oh. They're Optimus losing a war right now? If they're losing a war, I want to be the one that does it. Okay, you guys can balance the budget. Well, maybe you can't actually, but... Empire's becoming bloated. Collapsing under its own gluttony. Colony ship? There we go. But uh, nano cash is just too good to pass up, so... I'm a little concerned about a colony ship taking that route through kind of hostile space. Also, they're going to run out of fuel at one point as well. I think we're just going to change the route. Yay, but that is expensive. But approval went up, so we probably have a net positive here. Thirty-seven percent approval. Exceeding tolerance? Boy, how long is that penalty gonna stick around? Tempted to do things to make people happier. I won't, but it was tempting. There was a moment where I thought about it. I think from a research point of view, we might have to take a look at uh, technologies that'll make us rich. Where's the one where we can get stinking rich? I think I'll take Colonial Police. I'm okay with that. Galactic Currency Exchange, okay. Not that this is anywhere near what we can easily research. Okay. I'll take that one. <laughs> yes, nothing creates stability like a stock exchange.
But that's so far away, I don't think we can really count on it. We might just have to be a bit pickier about the buildings that I build. Welcome to the core, Andolf, the gray. I feel kind of bad that there's no like core space in between. Amarak might help that, but I don't know. I don't see it happening. Yay, supercomputers. Yeah, forget that. Oh, we do need the Galactonet, though. That's just too good. Just too good to pass up. Hmm. Not the most impressive production I've ever seen. Wouldn't mind sending out a few more troops that... Uh, I don't know. We'll hold back. We're probably good for now. Okay. I hope the polyps try going for... Oh! Are you sure you want to do that? That's a pretty impressive... Oh no, there's a little, little guys. So that's a pretty good fleet. Uh, we'll probably need the full force to intercept them. Yeah, we're going to catch them just fine. Stay still. Massive space battle. And I don't think we fully met up. That's okay. We should be able to go after these guys just with laser, lather, rinse, repeat. Laser, rinse, repeat. Okay, get out of here. Get out of here! And where's our super long range fellow? Eh, who cares? Forget that. Oh, they don't have fighters. This is not going to be pretty for them. <laughs> In we go with the zoom level. There they go. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was beautiful. Not close. And some of those ships are actually getting pretty outdated. Kaboom. Thank you. Oh look, we found where they live. That might be right on the edge of what we can reach, unfortunately. We're going to have to be uh, kind of lame here. Have them stop and refuel, because we're going to need every uh, ounce we can get. Galactica net! Not happening! Also, you haven't been the friendliest team. Ooh! Uh, 
Okay. So it's going to be a pretty brutal trade. There's our start. I don't want to give up too much money. Um, platinum is terrible. What are things that won't be helpful to them? Can have the unsavory cantina. I'm okay with giving. Ah, crap. I don't want to give him nano cash. You know, the easiest thing might just be going to war against them. And battle stations are kind of expensive, actually. Here, jerk. I'll buy some latinum off you for a while. That'll hopefully keep them off my back for a bit. That was actually the wrong Allentorm. They're doing just fine. Okay, this is very exciting. They're pretty much done, so we can pump up the research a whole bunch. Just trade the goods. It was bad for the budget, but good for everything else. They're getting pretty close as well. And I'm getting pretty careless. Looking good. Oh man, when all of those get done. Not sure why that one guy didn't go with them, but that's okay. I don't have to understand. I'm just the Emperor. As long as the trains run on time, I don't care. Yeah, building maintenance is eating everything up. Maybe a little bit more diamondite would not be a bad thing. go. Can you get there easily? Sure, not too bad. Their production's coming along nicely. I should probably import some people there. That's the Lucius system. Sure. It'll take a while to get there, but I'm okay with that. Almost the end of our super research push. Okay. Ah. <sighs> okay. But only because you guys are like my favorite race in the game. Smile on your brother, everybody get together. If you can sing along, uh, we'll say that's a gain get Dave points. All right, now, if they're gonna be cool for a bit, there's something that's been bugging me for a while, and that something is those dirty, cocky opterists. Actually, there's a lot of people I want to destroy in this game. So here's what we're going to do. 
We're going to get the fleet back together. We're going to get the band back together. And we're going to head to the wormhole. And I think we're going to actually attack the Opterus because I don't like how they were trash talking me, getting all up in my business. Oh, you want just a peaceful, nice, agreeable trade. Well, that's the one I want. But I like technology a bunch. No, we won't be able to make that happen. That'll upset him. I don't care. Now, secretly... Let's just talk to the Cordrazine real quick, because they actually might be the ones that have all of the uh, nano cache right now. I think they've been fighting with the Opterus over it. Because that system's gone back and forth a little bit. I hate them both. So, okay, we'll just go for the Cordrazine then. I'm okay with that. I mean, it would also kind of be convenient. Oh, there's just so many people we can go to war with. It's so hard to choose. Maybe we'll think about that more in the next episode. I'll see you there, everybody. Unless something happens right now, which it didn't.